good afternoon sir this is ankita dev so uh, being an undergraduate student in microbiology at times uh, i am i don't get the clarity that <clears throat> whether i want to do a research or go for a job <clears throat> so um, many people tell me that you need a lot of patience and everything for doing research <clears throat> i kind of have that patience and everything but um, sir can you enlighten me like what if i go into research and what like what my career will look like if i go into research or if i go into a job sector no at your point at your age at, at your understanding question is very relevant uh, if you talk about innovations at what they form what innovation you are doing that is important as we as you say that a job opportunity in industry if you talk all over the india it is true that bengal is a back stage this cannot be denied any industry which grows faster if it is backed by the innovation until unless a company is putting their efforts their r and d expenditures at a reasonably good level it cannot grow fast if you have to survive in the competitive world you have to do the investments there are two type of thoughts one i will do i will survive in the competitive environment another is i will i will do some innovation then i will see that opportunity are created to the my end consumer in much better way but there i will have more space to perform and increase the margins so innovations has always a a important role for any industry to grow fast exactly the people who want to engage themselves in the r&d activity when the industry looks at that i have to grow faster that is space is more important for any industry i always say that when you are doing on regular job it's become a need to job when you are doing the innovative jobs yes you are going to look it of course you that have you must have that level of grace that you can create a new thing you can think of new things you have a innovation mind in your uh, in your thinking and that can be reflected in your job yes in microbiology also there are a lot of innovations are going in our body now you know a probiotic can reduce your obesity now a manjuro number one drug last six month has been launched in india it is 90 80 90 crores in month of october glp1 this rules of probiotics are there our human body number of probiotic cells what we have in our body is more than the number of body cells what we have and we have been not been able to record all the probiotic what we have in our body what, what, what for they are responsible what for they are responsible what for they are responsible and that industry has taken a very big steps we have you know in our household we used to take uh, yogurt from these olds and yogurt is nothing but a probiotic marketing yogurt in a commercial way is also a very big business their innovations involved in a lab you have to culture your bacteria you have to culture your probiotic in such a way that we can produce commercially successful and sell in the market and then different probiotics have the different uh, benefit that benefit has to be cultured and placed among the people for the benefit. there you are already innovations are always there is it yes good